I uh, had sent samples uh, to the doTERRA lab and I had focused on juniper berry, lavender, and other things and just a small sample of helichrysum because I didn't think, you know, it was going to matter. Uh, a week later I get an email saying that they thought that I loves the helichrysum and uh, they said, can I produce 1500 kilos of helichrysum? And I said, well, I need this. So <laughs> we saw that this is where helichrysum grows naturally, uh, as well as most of the herbs that we need. So I was here 2019 okay. with you guys. Yes. I think all we had was over there. Yeah. It's totally different today. They've built uh, an entirely new, I think, 10 stills over there. So we have uh, full-time, now we have 43 employees. And then if you calculate the farm workers and the distillery workers, we're almost at 200 now. And then you said your farmer network was 600 for, that was just for Laurel? 600 for, for, for Helichrysum and for Lavender. And we, had, we hire locals here, but they've been working for us for a while now, so they're all sort of become family. And then if they're not our family, they're the family of the other owner too. Most of the times we help them plant. Most farmers can't afford to do all the tractor work and the seedlings. Helichrysum alone is potentially their only source of income for the year for some small farmers. And we've literally had people coming in in a horse-drawn carriage bringing their load to the distillery and I mean it kind of gets you a little bit emotional because you see these people that literally were like bent over like breaking their backs to get this in the middle of the heat in the summer to bring their bags and to you know get it weighed and get it put in and we want to have more of an impact of not just paying the farmers and helping them in that way for their revenue generation. We want to help them with hopefully the community in helping to build it. And you go to the field and you realize that the stuff that's coming out of the ground is what's going into the still, is what's going into the bottle. And uh, you know, just you can just see it. I think everyone believes it already, but when, when you see something uh, so obviously true to what we're talking about, you realize that this is the real deal.